What do you do for a living? I'm a senior DevOps, DevOps engineer. I work for IT company based on Kentucky. Nice. I work in the US. Nice. It's a medical insurance company. Awesome. How much money do you make? 120K per year. USD. That's USD. USD yeah. Are you happy with that sort of money? So far, so good. I'm a senior DevOps engineer. Like uh, that's a basic. Like 140 is like a minimum range over there in the US, but right, right. now 120, it's like I'm okay. But the job is really chill, so I'm just like a. Fair enough. It's really it has a lot of good work and life balance, so I'm really kind of impressed. I think you're already vibing here. So before we talk about that, what sort of education qualifications do you have? I have masters. I have masters from US. I have two bachelor's okay. degree and one masters from US. Yeah. Must have spent probably a fortune in that. Uh, yeah, I spent like a maybe 40. 40, 50 k. It was a public university back in New Mexico. Okay. I got my master's back in 2014 from New Mexico. So yeah, it's all almost almost nine years ago. So I would suspect that by now you won't have any debt, though. No, I don't. No, then like back then I had 30 k for sure. Okay. Yeah, I had like a, I have to pay my tuition fee. It was just in state because if you are an international student, you have to pay international fee, and it was like right. out of state. Right. So I was like, a, I'm a lawful permanent resident in the US right now, but back then it was uh, yeah. my international student, so I have to pay out of state. It was like 40 k total. So I okay. think so. In public university. How many years of experience again? Uh, almost uh, seven, eight years of experience in IT. Okay. Six, What's seven it? years or something. Like that. Also, if I may ask you, do you rent or do you own? Uh, rent. I rent in Dallas, Texas. I live in Dallas, Texas right now. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And uh, out here, we're facing a housing crisis. Like the moment you leave your housing space and you want to rent out another place, because of the rent control, if you continue to live in the same space, it's not a challenge. But the moment you want to rent out somewhere else, it's a challenge. How's it out there? Yeah, for sure. Because I had uh, like I have a few friends over here who is based in GTA, very yeah. total area, and they say it's a real real estate is really crazy over here, like NYC. We just came from NYC right now, so yeah. city is like a Manhattan is like a crazy over here. But it doesn't seem like in Toronto is kind of. Co- Calm down, relax, chill back, laid yeah, back time yeah. slack over here. So, but uh, Dallas, Texas is getting like suburbs. Okay. We just talk about real estate right now. It's booming right now. But you won't call it a crisis. No, like housing know. crisis. No, I know. Uh, Are you also planning to buy anytime in, ta- in Canada or in US? Yeah, in US? Oh, for sure. I'll buy like in suburbs for sure. Yeah, okay. real estate. It's it's going up. Okay. Because a lot of people are from California, New York are moving in Dallas, Texas. Okay. And so then uh, the real estate is really booming over there. So the prices are going up as well, like skyrocketing over there in DFW, Dallas, Fort Worth. Yeah. Yes, so you don't see any recession coming anytime soon? People are scared right now. There's a lot of, I work for 100% remote job. People okay. are getting like a lot of people are getting like Google, Apple. I work for one of the Fortune 500 companies, Fortune 50 company. Yeah. Yeah. So people are a little bit scared right now. Okay. Uh, people are really kind of uh, anxious about their job. But US is going to do, going soon. Decent so far, okay. I guess. I'm not t- not much concerned right now. Right. Yeah. One last question: Where are you from? Uh, original from Nepal, Kathmandu, Nepal. Like, yeah, okay. thank you so much. Yeah, right. thank you.